Well, they're asking for shoppers to take their own precautions, like we have been wearing these masks all day. They're also asking customers to please shop alone. It not only keeps the customers safe, it also keeps their staff safe. We saw plenty of customers shopping together at Metcalf's Monday, something the owner wants to stop for now. I'm just going to ask, you know, if you would please shop alone, it would be better for you um, to, you know, not expose yourself. It also would be better for our employees to be exposed to less people in our stores. Tim Metcalf says they've taken other steps as well, like not allowing reusable bags and reminding customers to social distance. We've done a really good job, I want to say, of never really getting more than three deep in our lines, um, keeping enough check lines open and having bakers and cashiers available. Other stores are taking similar steps. Meyer announced over the weekend they too are asking customers to shop alone. Trader Joe's is only allowing 50 people inside their stores at once. This photo shared with 12 News shows customers lined up down the block waiting for their turn to go inside. And starting Tuesday, Roundies will only allow 50% capacity inside pick and saves and metro markets. I think it's smart. Honestly, I wish everybody would do it. I mean, that's what we saw Trader Joe's did it last weekend, and we think it's smart. I mean, I think that's how we should all do it. As far as my wife and I not being able to shop together, it, it isn't really an inconvenience. It's just the way we've always, we've often done it. Caroline joins us once again. Caroline, how, how are these stores enforcing the rules? Well, like places like Trader Joe's, they are counting how many people are inside at once. If they've hit that 50 person limit, then they ask their customers to wait outside until someone comes out. Here at Metcalf's, the owner says they're just asking people. They're not actually enforcing it, but they do have these signs to remind folks outside as well, Patrick. Some big changes at the grocery store. Caroline, thank you.